What's going on everybody? As you might have guessed by the title of the video, I have sold a BMW. Uh, I'm pretty glad I sold it. That thing was a pile of shit. Uh, I'll make a video on that in the near future. Um, yeah, um, I'm not going to waste your time, not going to waste mine, so here it is. That's my uh, new pickup. It's a 2007 uh, GMC Sierra Vortec Max uh, SLE package. A um, few things about the truck. I uh, traded the car in for it. Uh, I paid $3,500 difference, which I think was a good deal. Um, I figured I had about $9,400 in the car. Bought it for $89, put a $500 in it. And uh, then traded it in for this thing, paid $3,500 difference. So I ended up paying about $12,900 for this pickup, which I think is a fantastic fucking deal. Um, Blue Book, these things go about $14 to $16. And uh, this one needs a little bit of work. Uh, it's got a little bit of rust here on the uh, back fender. These wheels are fucking awful. It's got really good tires on it. I uh, peeled off the, uh, let's see if I can figure this shit out. Here we go. I peeled off the, the uh, fucking door ding thing, whatever the hell they're called. Needs window tint. Um, no rust besides the box, and it really isn't that bad. Um, so here we go. It's uh, I uh, color matched the uh, chrome on the bottom. I think it looks a lot better. Um, Plasti dip, because it's way easier. Uh, needs tint really bad. It's got... It's a fucking fishbowl right now. Um, I threw the toolbox on it for my red pickup. Uh, needs a new one of these things. Like bed, whatever the hell, tailgate caps. Definitely needs a bed liner. Scratch to hell. Uh, before the, uh, the Carfax on this thing shows that it was a uh, work truck uh, for two different companies. It's got 120,000 miles, the first company put uh, about 30,000, the other one put about 90,000 on it. And honestly, I have no problem with it being a work truck. I mean, it was maintained meticulously. Um, I mean, they always did regular oil changes and when the maintenance needed done, they did it at the dealership. I got all the records for that. Everything was done at the dealership. So I'll take a little bit of wear and tear on the uh, uh, bed, a little bit of rust any day over a uh, poorly maintained vehicle. It is an SLE. I wanted a uh, SLT package because I like the interior way better. The uh, LTZ and the uh, SLT packages are my favorite. But overall, it's still pretty nice. The seat's six, it's got tan cloth interior. Um, Channeling down on some Cheetos and Monster. Going on a health kick, obviously. Uh, but the main reason I bought this pickup is because um, I'm really starting to get back in the lawn business pretty heavy. So uh, I needed something to pull my uh, trailer with and I really didn't want to borrow my dad's truck and my brother's truck all the time. So uh, I figured it didn't hurt and I wanted something pretty quick and the Vortec Max was the obvious, obvious uh, choice for that. Oh, if you want a Chevy and you want something pretty quick. Uh, it does have a six liter V8, makes about 376, 380 horsepower, about the same foot pounds. So it, it, the fucker gets up and goes, it tows, it tows, I've never reached this towing capacity, engine wise and transmission wise and cooling wise, but the, I definitely need to get some rare airbags because once it starts, once uh, you got a heavy trailer on there and you get up to interstate speed, it starts whacking the dog real bad. So I'm gonna put some airbags back there. Uh, it did come with dual exhaust, which is a uh, huge bonus. I was gonna do it anyway. I didn't really wanna spend the money on it. So it was nice, nice that it had that. I'm gonna get some chrome tips for it. Uh, my plan for this truck is to go all black. Uh, I'm gonna get 5% tint on the windows, about 45% on the front windshield. Black out the light, the rear tail lights. And uh, I'm gonna get some factory replica wheels, factory replica wheels for it, because I like I like those a lot. They're pretty cheap, and I can run these tires because these tires are almost brand new. So I'll be able to put 40,000 more miles on these tires if I don't do too many burnouts or do too many drifts. 
This thing, uh, <laughs> if you uh, turn out tra trash control and hammer down on it, it'll get sideways, no problem. And these are uh, 12 inch, 12 and a half wide tires with pretty decent tread on it. So, uh, yeah, the rust is, I'll get that fixed or buy a new box or something, I don't know yet. Shouldn't be too, it's not too big of a deal. But yeah, uh, needs a little bit of work. I put, uh, the speakers were blown in it when I bought it. Needs a new windshield, uh, tint. It smelled a little bit like cigarettes. But overall, I got a smoking fucking deal on this thing. Really happy with it. I put about 4,000 miles on it already in a month and a half. So, never had a single issue with it. Uh, I'm just coming up with my first oil change. So, yeah, uh, tell me what you guys think in the comments. Uh, there's going to be a lot more com uh, content on this thing uh, in the next coming weeks and months. So, yeah, I hope you guys like it. Pre uh, please comment, rate, and subscribe for more.